combination sum. The idea is we're given an array of distinct integers and we want to find all the combinations that sum up to the target value. So for every number, we have a choice. Do we include that number or do we skip it? We can include two or we can skip two. We can actually include the same number multiple times. So we can end up with something like this or maybe we skip the two and then here we will only be able to choose from the remaining elements. So let's start with a little bit of boilerplate. So the two base cases are going to be we have the target sum. So we'll create a copy of this array and append it to the result. The other base case is where we have an invalid combination. The recursive case has two choices. We either include the current element and then we can run our DFS recursive call. We can consider the other case where we have to now undo this work and then call DFS except we don't update the total. The only thing I missed is we didn't need to put I plus one here just because we choose the current candidate doesn't mean we can't choose the same one again and you can see it works 